It's Christmas season in Assassin's Creed Valhalla, or technically it's called the Yule Festival. And once you get to the bonfire and you've been introduced to this kind of black hole festival, there is a guy here, Norvid, that you can speak to, who will be selling you some items that you can purchase using these special Yule coins that you can earn by doing certain events and quests around this whole festival. So basically it's a set of armor called the Modranda Hit ceremonial kind of gear, which is a bit weird, like I can't pronounce that at all, it's pretty crazy. There's also a pretty good shield and a dagger up for sale as well, and most of these cost a bunch of Yule coins. You can also get settlement cosmetics and tattoo cosmetics. Now there's four ways to earn Yule coins. The first one that you'll find, it, no doubt, is by actually just speaking with the first lady that you're going to encounter, and you're going to be entering a fighting tournament with 10 rounds. And keep in mind, you don't generate health as you do each round, so make sure you don't actually lose your fights. Um, this might actually be really difficult, <laughs> but it gets funny because the further you go on, you fight people who are like really strong, and some of them that are using like this drunk kung fu, kung fu and they're like trying to hit you with their ass, trying to hit you with their head, and it all ends up with this final opponent who's a beast. Every time he grabs you, he will do massive damage. You can see I was down to like, I don't even have any heals anymore, and I was just barely able to beat all 10 rounds and once you actually beat the kind of like final round guy you do end up winning about 70 coins which is not great 70 coins for about like 15 minutes of like fights it's not the greatest way to do it there's also a easier way to do it is if you do the drinking game the drinking game is one of the quickest ones to do the drinking race takes about a minute to do provided you win, of course, and you get about 10 coins per win. So that's 10 coins every minute, but that's not the best way to get coins or to farm coins in the game. The best way to farm coins in the game is actually through the archery. Now, this only applies if you're actually good enough at aiming and getting a really high score. Usually, if you get your score near the 2000s, you can get 40 coins for two minutes of work. So that's like 20 coins every minute, which is the highest earning one that I've seen so far that you can repeat the process of. All you have to do is aim for the red ones as a priority when you see these red targets, and then the yellow ones, and then the green ones. Ideally, you wanna hit every single target that you see all the time. Just hit the red ones first because they don't show for too long. So on the screen, just aim and shoot everything. Try to get the red ones first because you see they do disappear before the other ones disappear. So immediately go for the red ones as you see them, then yellow ones and then green ones because that's how it will show. As long as you're hitting them fast enough, you should be able to reach a high score, get near the 2000s, as long as you just focus on those red ones. Every single time you see a red one, you have to hit it. If you miss a red one, you are in big trouble because you just sacrificed a lot of points, as well as the yellow ones. Generally, you just wanna kind of just hit everything. And when you get to that final stage where the final stage shows everything, you're gonna wanna hit the red ones, then the yellow ones, and then the green ones, so that if you do miss any, you're missing the green ones rather than the high-earning red ones or the high-earning yellow ones. I found, personally, that this was the best way to earn Yule coins in this whole festival because the archery only takes two minutes. You get 40 coins. You can literally spend maybe like 20 minutes just kind of farming this over and over, and you should have enough coins to buy everything in the shop that you desire, at least the gear and the, the weapons, for that matter. There are two other ways to get a handful of coins, and those are the side quests that you get along with the game or the, the event here. And that's the, the case of the missing ale and then the cow catcher. Those two quests actually give you quite a bit of, of coins. I know the cow the cow hunting one actually gives you 140 Yule coins just for doing it. So definitely try to do those first because there's like a nice quick kind of handout. You do have to do a little bit of a, like a quest and adventure out, but it's something a bit more interesting than farming archery over and over and over again. If your archery isn't that good, your best bet is actually just doing the drinking race for that one minute every 10 coins and just keep doing that for like half an hour. <laughs> that's a lot of drinking, half an hour, just constantly drinking. But yeah, that's the best way to farm Yule coins and get all the items and festive stuff going on in Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in a future one. Thank you so much for watching.